All right, let's get started with a rapid updates video on gold and silver. And I'm going to touch on as well cryptocurrency because I think you need to diversify that basket, if you know what I mean. And speaking of baskets, tomorrow is May Day. Tomorrow's May Day 1st. And we know what that means too for all you apes out there. Time to buy silver. If you haven't already, should have got started. Everybody just takes an ounce of physical silver off. It's a way to contribute to the Silver Squeeze 2.0. Looking at Reddit here on this post, it's got over 600 upvotes. Doing my part since November. Cashed in most of my mutual fund fiat taxable for real money. And yes, go Gold and silver is real money. It's sound money. Awesome post there. Let's look at some others. Here are four ounces. Silver comes in all shapes and sizes. Make sure you join the Reddit community if you want to share your silver collection. And just remember everyone, it's not always about the silver spot price. It's also the collectible part of collecting silver and gold and coins and different types of coins and bullion. Who here is a coin collector? Comment below. Mayday, mayday, mayday. Let's all fight by physical silver. Hashtag Mayday Silver. This is going down tomorrow, May 1st. Silver Squeeze 2.0. And I want to talk about, as we move on with this video, just how important physical silver and gold can be. Cryptocurrency is also, if you're into it, it's also decentralized and it's also another vehicle to park your fiat currency, but you got to diversify. In my opinion, this is what I'm doing. And I'm just simply sharing with you and talking like a friend. This is what I do. Cryptocurrency is awesome, but what if the power in the power grade goes out? You want to have some physical physical constitutional legal tender and it's written in article article 1 section 10 that silver and gold is used as constitutional legal tender so just keep that in mind when it comes comes down to something like that if it ever does hope it never does but this is why we collect silver and gold is to store value in real sound money last one here my wife showing me the silver chart awesome it's such a cute photo did i just say cute yeah i guess so gold and silver prices we've had a little pullback 1769 for gold 25.90 for an ounce of silver it was hovering around over 26 dollars per ounce of silver this week then we had the federal reserve came out and had their meeting on wednesday on inflation then you had later that night the president of the united states came out and addressed he wants more big government and more more taxes on the rich well if you just say raising taxes on the rich you're raising taxes on everybody in my opinion and really it just sends a message it discourages people from being successful building businesses becoming rich it's almost as if we're discouraging from people from from making money living the american dream however this is totally my opinion again silver gold maybe some cryptocurrency you have to find multiple streams of income. You cannot live on just one, one income stream anymore. Those days are over. Looking at Yahoo Finance, S&P is down 31.57. The Dow 30 is down over 200 points. NASDAQ is down and we're all in the red. Crude oil is at $63. So therefore gold and silver is down as well. It's mirroring that. Looking at coin market cap, Bitcoin is rallying, coming back. Ethereum is just taking off to the moon. We have XRP and Cardano. Everything is in the green, including some people's Dogecoin favorite is at 33 cents. You may not be in, interested in cryptocurrency, but it is making a run. I myself, I definitely hold cryptocurrency and I'm really starting to like where things are headed. And maybe it's time for people to start looking at it. And it's getting a lot of attention from other corporations, businesses, banking institutions. Don't be the last one to get started and open up an account using some sort of an exchange wallet. Bitcoin.com. Coinbase now allows millions of customers to buy cryptocurrency with PayPal. And I'm just going to let you know I am an affiliate of Coinbase. My link is down below if you want to set up an account today. Here we go. Here's a prime example. America's fifth largest banking institution, U.S. Bank, to offer cryptocurrency custody. The mass adoption is taking place. And you know this guy, Jerome Powell, these, they don't like it. They're going to always talk it down because the dollar is the world's currency. Well, the dollar is falling. The dollar has devalued since 
Bretton Woods. Ever since they came off the gold standard, the dollar has fallen. European Investment Bank distributes 121 million in Ethereum-based digital bonds. You have Dogecoin on Ellen DeGeneres' show. They're talking about it everywhere now. And other countries are accepting it. They want to regulate it. You know, it's going to be regulated, but it's decentralized. These cryptocurrencies are decentralized. There's no government saying you got to do this. You got to do that. The government is just going to want to tax it. They want that money. When I see headlines like this, gold, silver, miners, bullish all over the world, plus insanity. I just think that gold and silver, it's been around for thousands of years. And with our chaotic banking system, we see headlines. What's happening with the banks is about to ripple through financial markets all over the world lots of banks all over the world countries are buying up gold we have to follow what these big banks are doing and should you be doing the same and from what i'm reading here the banks are trying to stimulate their economies by doing exactly what the united states is doing they're printing more stimulus checks alert is right right here alert gold is laughing at pal and right here behaving like an ass indicator gold and silver preparing for takeoff soaring prices only getting worse and what if gold takes off and what if silver takes off the last time we saw $50 per ounce silver was back in the 1980s and doesn't it seem wrong that we are half the price of silver's all-time high sitting around $25 per ounce highly manipulated we know silver is north of $50 per ounce we know it's probably even more than $100 per ounce where are you gonna be when that day comes we know that China does not like dealing with the USD. They want out of the petrodollar. They want to become the, the world's superpower. That's why they came out first with their CBDC, Central Banking Digital Currency. China is opting out of the US-run financial system. The US government doesn't lead financial innovation. China will leapfrog it and control the world's emerging monetary infrastructure. Now you have the Biden administration, the Federal Reserve, scrambling to get some sort of a digital currency going for the U.S. dollar. People are a little disappointed with gold's performance right now. This headline, gold, bulls frustrated by disappointing price actions and are taking a break. Let me hit the high spots. Now is not the time to throw in the towel for gold, he says. Gold is struggling now, but at some point it will... It will have its day in the sun. Gold is doing what it does best, frustrating gold investors. But the message in this article is, hey, patience, patience. Here's a survey. People are bullish, 53% bullish on gold. Main Street, bullish. So let me hit some top headlines here. Perfect headline for what I was talking about earlier. Why taxing the rich? always end up landing on the middle class instead here you have uber lyft doordash plunge after biden official says gig workers should be employees just trying to get out there and make some extra money people trying to have a second or a third income stream now they want you to be employees it's you can't own a business here you have the central banks remain in a wait and see mode central banks don't even know all they know is what are they doing they're running towards gold they're getting into cryptocurrency they're starting to learn the blockchain giant gold coin weighs 22 pounds and took 400 hours to create look at this coin queen elizabeth it was created to mark the final of the Royal Mint's Queen's Beast Collection, a series of collectible coin designs based on 10 statues created for the Queen as a guard of honor at her 1953 coronation. This is what coin collecting is all about. You love a piece of art? We're seeing that in gold and silver. I mean, how could you not love gold and silver? The world's most expensive Tesla is covered in gold. The Model S plaid customized by Caviar retails for just under 300 a thousand amazing look at that it's beautiful give me a thumbs up on this video if you like this content you want me to keep continuing with rapid updates let's look at this silver headline here silver is set for buyers on industrial demand demand for silver in industries is going high solar panels ev medical silver is used for almost everything not only that but i was listening to a podcast nasa is using a lot of silver as well because it's the most affordable 
conductor out there. So keep that in mind too, as when they start talking about space exploration and also used in a lot of our warheads. Moving on with these headlines, dollar set for the fourth week drop on Davish Fed. The US dollar skidded toward a fourth straight weekly decline against the basket of major peers on Friday. Thank you for being on this rapid updates video. Make sure you subscribe and check out our Telegram group, free to join. The link is down below in the description. We'll see you on the next video.